hello YouTube welcome back to my video so in this video I'm going to show you how to solve uh, the error cannot start a tomcat server and uh, this will be the message server may be already running in another process or system process or maybe using the port and uh, you have to change the port number okay so I'll be showing how to solve this error and why this error comes okay so uh, just to demonstrate uh, the error I have opened my Eclipse in two uh, different workspace this is one workspace and uh, this is another workspace and I have created two uh, uh, dynamic web projects one is this one test and here is test again two uh, web project has been created now let me uh, uh, start the server in this Eclipse uh, workspace so to start the server just right click on that and just click start or you can go to directly any index page or JSP page and right click on that and just click run on server okay now you can see here the uh, Tomcat server has been started so the, if there is any page so just to show it let me create an index page here so I'm running this one you can see here yes uh, it's loading completely yes it's loaded okay you can see here it's loaded so there is no error in this now let me go to the next eclipse next eclipse workspace here uh, in the test again i'm here also i'm just creating a new jsp page same index.jsp and now if i'm just uh, trying to run uh, this uh, on run on server definitely it will be an error because i'll show you why the error comes okay let the error pop up yeah here it is the error several ports 8080 required for tomcat c is already in use okay which means uh, the server port uh, is already in use and uh, we can see the port number in the properties no just uh, double click on that it will uh, open up uh, the server editor and uh, you can see here we are using 8080 port number for this eclipse workspace okay now if um, if uh, we are trying to uh, start this server definitely there will be a you can see here this is the port number 8080 definitely there will be an error now if i am just uh, stopping this server and uh, if i'm if I'm starting this one, it should start because uh, that that, uh, that one uh, it is releasing that uh, server. I mean uh, port and uh, here I'm taking that port again from uh, that uh, port number. I'm just again taking from that server. Okay, so here it is. It's opening. So in this demonstration, we just uh, stopped the Tomcat service in from the workspace one and uh, and then started in workspace two. So what if we want? I want to start uh, the tomcat server in both the workspace so what java actually uh, the tomcat is actually suggesting is uh, to change the port number as you can see i'm just running again this one the error will uh, pop up again yes so it is saying like change the port number okay to change the port number so just change the port number here to 8081 or uh, any any number okay any port you can use i'm just uh, using it as 8019 so However, these these ports are not uh, not uh, using in, in any other website in any uh, any other service and change this 8005 to 8006 and just press Ctrl uh, S to save this information and now let me go to the index.jsp and run uh, the server as, as a nice server here we go you can see here this this uh, a server from the workspace one is loaded and uh, the server from the workspace 2 is loaded as you can see the port number is 8080 here and in this project it is a port number 8081 so we have just changed the port number and used it okay now i have just demonstrated with two workspaces now what if you are uh, starting your web project for in one eclipse and one uh, workspace and uh, there won't be two workspaces like this as I shown so we have to check which service is actually 80 using the port 8080 okay now uh, let me close uh, uh, the workspace one we don't need it anymore let me close this completely 
here it is uh, back to my workspace 2 uh, which i am using 8080 as the port now to check uh, the uh, which service is actually using the port just go to uh, start menu and just search for resource monitor and uh, in the network section you can see a listening ports where you can see 8080 8009 and 8005 is actually using by java so if we are stopping this service uh, in that uh, your pc uh, the server should start again okay now let me uh, try to stop that to stop it just go to star uh, task manager and uh, just go to the process where you can see java.exe is the chess click on end process just end that process and close it completely so in the same instance when i stopped that service and uh, i stopped that process you can see my server has been stopped okay so uh, this is what you have to do when uh, that error is coming that port number 8080 or any other port is uh, used by any other process first in the resource monitor check that uh, which service is actually using that port go to the uh, process in the task manager and end that uh, process okay so if i, I can now just start the uh, tomcat server okay so in this tomcat also same we have to do we have to stop the ja 8080 port service and normally it is used by java only okay hope you got this i have demonstrated every possible way uh, the uh, this error is popping up and how we can uh, solve it and if you want to run the tomcat in any other port number you can also run that okay so if you have if you have any doubt in this please comment below i'll be helping you and uh, please like and subscribe for my videos and thanks for watching.